I play Sonali, I'm one of the Jodi Breakers. Independent, quirky, fun, uh, smart, um, and uh, she is good at her job, and that's why she's partnered with Sid. She believes uh, in uh, love, she believes in marriage, yet she is a Jodi Breaker. She is uh, a person who believes that um, two people need to be in a relationship only for the sake of love. And if there's no love and love has flown out of the window, then you need to separate because uh, life gives you another chance to find your soulmate, uh, the one you can you know, actually love and fall in love with. So she's not the believer of those uh, quintessential, you know, typical, uh, you know, the way you are brought up thinking that love happens only once. She's not a believer of that. At the same time, she's uh, fun loving. She is very gregarious by nature. She makes friends easily. Um, she laughs out loudly without thinking. She's Her quirks are very much like mine. So in a way, I see a lot of uh, myself in Sonali. There is a need of jewelry breakers in today's time in the society because there are a lot of unhappy couples who don't know how to separate and move on in life. And they need these you know, outsiders to come and tell them and advise them how to do it. Kind of uh, roles that uh, you know, I have done, I have always tried to choose something that is not uh, really close to my real self. And that was a conscious decision I had taken when I started acting. I have never touched the, the middle path, the real path, the contemporary today, uh, you know, a normal character. Uh, so I think uh, this is one of the first and um, the script really attracted me to it. And it's coincidental that Sonali happens to be like me. I don't make a plan in my career. I've never planned to be an actor and I've never planned my next step. Um, and I don't think so much when I sign a film. I just like the script, I like my character and I do it. And uh, I have no inhibitions and no uh, qualms into, to play any particular character. Whatever I want to play, I know I will be able to play that. Madhavan is a kind of actor who has a lot of, uh, you know, he pays a lot of attention to details. And it's not about detailing of his own character, but everybody. Uh, in terms of every scene was discussed, even though it's written before, uh, you know, and if he thought that, you know, something is amiss, he would go to Ashwini and tell him, or he would go to that, act, uh, you know, that particular actor and ask them, that, do you think if you do it this way, is it going to help your character? And um, it's, it's very beautiful to see that because generally actors are very selfish. They're always concerned with what they are doing in a particular frame. And it's nice when you understand that it's, always the combined effort of everything put together that makes a good film and I'm a believer of that so when I see Madhavan uh, do that um, I have a feeling that he would make a wonderful director I don't really have the understanding of an item number <laughs> but I'm going to call it a dance number item number whatever it is supposed to be um, Bollywood is always in sync with dance numbers you can't have uh, a typical Hindi film without a dance number because people actually love dancing. So we have a song which is very special, it's on my name and um, I was very apprehensive of it. Well I read the script and I wanted to actually flip through it but I had landed up reading the entire script at one go and I totally loved it and I told my manager that this is a film that I want to do and I suggested Madhavan's name for it, uh, for Sid. At that point of time there was no other conversation and it was kind of forgotten by me and I got busy with my other roles. Uh, we couldn't trace it for a while and then finally, you know, I had a conversation with Omi when I was shooting for players and uh, he kind of told me what he's doing next and it sounded like the film that, you know, I had read. And uh, then I asked Tanuja to check and then it happened that uh, so that, you know, Maddie was already signed for it. So it was amazing. I think I was destined to be a part of Jodi Breakers and uh, that's how I got it. First time I chased the script and got it. Uh, Ras 3, working on that has been very nostalgic because, uh, you know, Vishesh film streets like I'm their little kid because I did my second film and many films with them there on. Um, Vikram Bhatt working with him, he's the director who actually got me interested in acting and also told me that I'm really lucky in life to get so many opportunities and that I should take up acting seriously. And he got me actually going as an actor. Uh, so when I work with him, this is a very special script and a very challenging role for me in Raz 3. Um, I feel really good because um, I think he also needs his due uh, and he's going to get it with this film because it's fantastic. Well, the top five films, um, Ajnabi, Raz, uh, which was a Golden Jubilee, uh, Jisun, Corporate. Now, a couple of films that I've done, I'm very excited uh, with Singularity and Jory Breakers. And definitely a very special film that is uh, Shop Charitra Kalponik. That's my Bengali film.